Hey everybody and welcome back to another Kraken Packs video. I am your host, Miss Peppers. That's right, we're back with box number three of Ikoria. Right? Box number three of Ikoria. Let's see if our box topper is absolutely just ruined. Is it a dumpster fire waiting to be waiting to be revealed? We will find out. We will find out together. Right now. Well, it looks like it's in okay shape. So far, we've been very lucky. So far, we've been very lucky. Something I mentioned in the first video, if you didn't didn't catch that, and that is that these boxes actually have enough room for you to put a whole nother pack in there, and it still closes just fine. All right, I actually have, if I put this back in the box, if you missed this on the first video, essentially, right, I can put that back in there. I do have some extra packs here. Let's let's put this back like so. Right, so this is now even. Three across the board. We've got we've got these three booster packs. Put them in like this. Close this up. Look at that. There's a little bit of plastic sticking out there, but like look at that. There's not even any like pressure to keep this like the box is still and this is damaged. This box is even damaged. But like there's no, like, I don't have to put any pressure on this to keep it together. It's not, it's not, like, ballooned. So there's a whole, there's enough room in this for there to be 39 booster packs. Why all the extra space? For this tiny little thing? For this tiny little thing, you put all this extra space? No wonder people's cards were getting ruined. Let's get into it. Let's get into it. What are we looking for? We're going to look through the commons because we got to see if we can find those alternate arts. Right? That's an important piece of this puzzle. Commons off there. Weaponize the monsters. Storm Wild Caprador. There you go. Lurking a Boneyard Lurker. As a nice alt art. Very nice. And we've got a Genius Ultimatum as our first rare. And then, of course, we have a token and a land card. I need to move some things around here. Give me uno momento. There we go. Done. Done duded, as they say. Is that what they say? I think that's what the kids say these days. All right, done duded. Keensight Mentor, General's Enforcer, Porky Parrot, and Lutri, our little precious otter baby that was banned before his time. Well, banned probably appropriately. Let's be honest. Probably banned appropriately. Uh, but, like, still, you know. Didn't even, did he, he didn't even get a chance. They murdered my sweet boy. Avian Oddity. Back for more. Frill Scare Mentor. And Yorion. My goodness, the next card that's going to get banned, right? Because everyone's like, holy moly, this card is broken and it's it's breaking standard. I guess it's, is it also uh, running amok in modern and stuff now? I don't know. Hey, look at that. We got a nice Vulpakeet alt art. There you go. We got a Regal Leosaur. Reconnaissance Mission. Sanctuary Smasher. And, ooh, our first mythic of the box. And it's me. It me. That, that me right there. That guy right there. At least that's what I've been told by a few people. A few folks have said, hey, this card is just you, Mr. B. And I'm like, I mean, like, I, you know, if I was as ripped as him, sure. Sure. I'm definitely not as ripped as him. I think they're just making a comment about the fact that I'm bald. You know? Skull Prophet. Zagaroth Mamba. Auspicious Sterix. And Luris, my goodness, opening up all the companions out of this box. Tranquil Cove and Human Soldier. Luris is a good hit. I mean, probably going to get banned soon, right? If not already, right? I guess the, the ban and restricted announcement would have come out this past Monday. Maybe it's already banned that I'm recording this on the weekend before the Monday and making a fool of myself four days from now when this video comes out. Sprite Dragon. Insatiable Hemorrhophage. Savai Crystal and Kahira, the Orphan Guard. Okay, that's 
We're five, we're six packs in? Six packs in and we have four companions. I mean, all right. Sure. Sounds good. Looking for those alt arts, not seeing them. Mystic Subduel. Indrathera Crystal. Channeled Force. And our first Triome. Not an alt art Triome, but our first Triome. There you go. Got a, oh, our first garbage card. First garbage ad card. For those of you who uh, missed it, I did a opening of a fat pack from Morning Tide, and uh, I talked about the tokens and the ad cards because the old ad cards from sets like that have ads on them, but then they have useful information on one side. Why did they have to make these double-sided with the same information? What was the purpose? What's the purpose? You're completely ruining your chance of having a sex essentially additional free ad space. Zenith Flare. Boon of the Wish Giver. And we've got Titan's Nest. Ooh, look at that. That is gorgeous. That is absolutely gorgeous. Foil Archipelagor. Archipelagor? Archipelagor. It's really hard to say because it's archipelago, right? Is is the way that you normally say that word. But because they've added the RE, it makes it like a weird O sound. Gorgeous card though in foil. The alt arts are great, and then having the alt arts in foil is just even better. Like just like chef chef's kiss. Mwah. Let's move along, right? We need to pick up the pace. Pick up the pace, Mr. B. Okay, okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Frondland Felidar. I like to ramble. If you didn't know that by now, welcome to my channel. I ramble. Lord, I was born a rambling bee. We got a nice Dreamtail Heron. We got Rooting Moloch. Grim Dancer. Lore Dracus and Offspring's Revenge. So we've hit two of the enchantments, four of the companions, one mythic. All right, we've got Exuberant Wolf Bear, Unbreakable Bond, Grim Dancer, and Mythos of Nethroi. It's a really good card. I like it. Worded terribly, in my opinion. Destroy target non-land permanent if it's a creature. Or if green and white was spent to cast this spell. Just it's a weird way of wording it. Migration Path. Will of the All Hunter. Bastion of Remembrance. Oh yeah! Sky Cat Sovereign. The little tiny kitty cat. Mew Mew. Mew Mew. Until it gets big and then it goes Mew. And you're like, oh, that that's a large flying cat. That is a large flying cat. We got another Vulpakeet. We got a Proud Will Bonder. A Void Beckoner. Ivy Elemental. And another Triome. Very nice. This time the Jeskai Triome. Very good, very good. My brain didn't want to work there for a moment. You all heard it. You heard the, huh, my brain, it's doing a thing. Trumpeting Nar, Migration Path, Heartless Act, and Yadaro, the Wandering Giant Turtle. <laughs> Yadaro just makes me, just makes me think of the Canyonero song. Canyonero. Yadaro. Exuberant. It's not enough syllables, I guess, but that's, you know, still, same kind of idea, though. Zagoth Mamba, Lead the Stampede, and Kogla. This card is great. I love this card. It's so good. Fights a thing when it comes into play. Fights a thing when it comes into play, and then when it attacks, it blows up enchantments and artifacts, right? Yeah. It's so good. It's such, it's such a card that people have to deal with when you play it. I'm playing it in Brawl on Arena a bunch. It's lots of good times. Flourishing Fox. 
Zagoth Crystal. And we've got a Voracious Great Shark. It's the Maneater right there. Foil Solid Footing. That's our second foil from the box. And we're halfway through. Halfway through, second foil from the box. Ooh, we got a nice Great Horn there. Very nice. So the Great Horn there. Look at that guy. Gorgeous. The alt arts are just gorgeous. Monstrous Step, Cunning Night Bonder, Ominous Sea, and Umori, the Collector. Cool, cool. Umori is like right up my alley of like the companion that I would probably want to play if I was going to play because I like to play super non interactive magic. I like to be like, here are my creatures, deal with them. Easy prey. Wingspan Mentor, Escape Protocol, and Titan's Nest again. Two copies of Titan's Nest out of this box so far. We are very short on Mythics at the moment. Very short on Mythics at the moment. Our alt arts are pretty good though. We've got some, we've got what, five and then a foil one? Pretty good. Neutralize, Blitz of the Thunder Raptor, Splendor Mare, and oh, well, speaking of Mythics and alt arts. How about an Aluna? Apex of Wishes? Teamer. Good old Teamer right there. Gorgeous alt art. Gorgeous alt art. Okay, we've got Jubilant Skybonder. Void Beckoner. There you go. Another alt art. Archipelar Gore. Archipelar Gore. Archipelago or something like that, right? Something like that. And then we've got a Gigantha, another companion. Where what are we short? We're just short the Boros one and the We're short a few, right? Because we only have five, six. So we're short four still. But still, it's pretty good. And then we got a foil corpse churn. Scoured Barons, human token. I mean to hit that many companions out of one box is pretty good. Like, the first couple boxes we opened, we only hit, like, I think, like, four or five companions. We're at six now. Fight is one, and we're not even... Ha we're, like, just over halfway through the box. Unbreakable Bond. There's another nice alt art. The alt arts in this are just phenomenal. they just absolutely gorgeous. And we've got an Emergent Ultimatum. Emergent Ultimatum. First uncommon is a Sanctuary Lockdown, followed by Footfall Crater, followed by Sanctuary Smasher. Our rare is a Song of Creation. Ooh, Foil Mythic. Foil Snap Decks, Apex of the Hunt. Sweet. I will take it. I actually really like uh, Snap Decks as a, like, as a commander, because that, that uh, mutate cost is not terrible and its ability is sweet four damage to target creature or planeswalker and opponent controls and gain four life very cool yeah i'll take it i will take it swallow hole ivy elemental Stormwind, wind uh, storm wild caprador and labyrinth raptor the labyrinth raptor is a really cool card in limited as well like giving essentially your creatures with menace an ability that says, by the way, opponents have to sack a creature, right? Sack one of the things blocking it. It really, like, messes up their block patterns. Another full art Vulpakeet there, or alt art Vulpakeet. Will of the All Hunter. Alert Heed Bonder. Ominous Seas again. And, all right, we got an alt art Dirge Bat. Cool. That's our rare, and we have another foil in the back here. We've got a foil of one mind. Sweet little draw card. This card's great because it costs two less if you control a human and non-human, right? And you draw two cards. Um, so you can play it in like the red-blue limited decks and play uh, this one right here. No, not Cathartic Reunion. What is it? This one. This one right here. Forbidden Friendship. For two mana on turn two, you play this. You get a one and a one, right? A one-one human and a one-one dinosaur. Turn three, you can now play up one mind for one blue mana. It's pretty solid. Pretty solid. 
I've seen it go off a number of times in Limited. Trumpeting Nar, Poliwog Symbiote, Ragoon, uh, Raugrin Crystal, and our rare is a Unpredictable Cyclone. With a Mountain and a Soldier token. What do we got? Wingspan Mentor. Ooh, we got a Alt Art Trumpeting Nar. This card looks phenomenal in foil as well. We got a Glowstone Recluse. And we got another copy of Kahira, the Orphan card. So doubles up of that. Couldn't we do doubles up of Lurus? I'll double up of Lurus seems good. Ooh, we got a Cavern Whisperer. Nice little Cavern Whisperer there. We've got a Call of the Death Dweller. We've got Duskfang Mentor. Another Alt Art card, two in one pack, is pretty cool. Necro Panther. And then we've got Zerda, the Dawn Waker. There you go. With a foil, Rumbling Rock Slide. Okay. Our foil count is actually pretty low, this box, too. Mythic count is only at two, technically. We have three, but one's a foil. Like, so the mythic count is really low. The foil count is really low. Let's see what the last few packs uh, contain for us on this box. Reptilian Reflection, Proud Wild Bonder, Boneyard Lurker, and Whirlwind of Thought with a foil Sanctuary Smasher. I feel like we're going to get a run of foils here in the last few packs. Because, like, the foil count should be somewhere around, like, 11, 12, 13-ish. Huntmaster Liger. Momentum Rumbler, Chittering Harvester Alt Art, very nice. And then we've got a Lava Brink Adventurer with a Foil Rare, Foil Mythos of Nethroi. Cool, cool, cool. Seb McKinnon Art, I'll take it, especially in Foil. Sanctuary Lockdown, Weaponize the Monsters. Flame Spill, and Emergent Ultimatum, our second copy of that card from this box as well. Still really short on Mythics here. We should be seeing at least one more, I would think. I mean, we should be seeing two more, really, um, since the foil shouldn't be counting toward the, the Mythic count. We got Keen Sight Mentor. Ooh, we got a Porky Parrot Alt Art. Absolutely hilarious looking. Cool Art, just hilarious looking. Glowstone Recluse. And there, okay, there's their Mythic. Vadrock Apex of Thunder, the Jeskai uh, legendary mutate creature. Very cool, very cool. And a foil blossoming sands. Happy day. Happy day. I don't know, would I take a foil basic over one of the foil like cons lands? I don't know, because the cons lands in this set do are new art, at least, right? Titan Rex. if they had used just the same art again, it would have been like, ugh. The cons lands are back again. Majestic Oracorn, Barrier Breach, and Inspired Ultimatum with a foil Regal Leosaur. How many uh, foils in a row is that now? Maybe I put a counter up on the screen. How many foils in a row have we opened in the last row of this box? I think it's got to be at least four or five at this point. Call of the Death Dweller, Valiant Rescuer, Dire Tactics, and Voracious Great Shark, another duplicate. Oh, and there ends, see, I said something, and then the foil train left the station. It was like, I'm out. You, 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 you called me out, I'm out. I'm not sticking around. If you're going to call me out like that, I'm just leaving. Cavern Whisperer, alt art, very nice. Ho Hornbash Mentor, Alert Heedbonder, Ketria Crystal, and Yadaro, another duplicate. Lots of dupes in this box. Hey, look, another junk card. Toss. Toss it. Toss it away. Throw it away. No one wants it. Easy Prey. General's Enforcer. Savai Crystal. And Gem Razor. Very cool. Gem Razor is a great little card. And we got another foil. Foil Honey Mammoth. All right. Oh, there's the Kraken token. Nice. So I think we're still short a Mythic, in my opinion. We only got three. Um, technically, we got four if you count the foil. But the foil doesn't count toward the Mythic 
like the, the percentages of pulling a mythic in the box. Uh, Pouncing Shore Shark alt art, very nice. Primal Empathy, Savai, uh, Savai Thundermane. And, okay, well, there you go. See, we were short a mythic. Snapdax. Now we got two. We got a foil one and a regular one in the same box. And then we got a foil in this pack too, Grim Dancer. There you go. Look at that. Hey, look, another garbage card. Nobody cares. So how many foils do we end up with? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So that's about right, 12. I think we got a fair number of alt arts though, right? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. We got 18 alt arts, one of them being foil. Pretty good. That's pretty good for a box. I don't think we've had that high on any of the other boxes. Um, we only hit two triumphs, which is pretty low for a box. And I, you know, I mean, like I would like to have had some alt art triumphs, of course. But I mean, you can't always get those. We gotta make sure we open up this too, right? Don't forget the, uh, don't forget the 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 special card, the box topper, right? That's the important part. What we get? Ooh, that's pretty cool. Destroy a perfect life form. This is the Phoenix. The Phoenix looks really cool in the uh, the the Godzilla art. That's pretty sweet. So there you have it, everybody. We hit a lot of companions. We hit doubled up on one companion. We doubled up on one ultimatum. Titan's Nest. Uh, Yodaro. Voracious Great Shark. So that's what? One, two, three, four, five doubles. Technically six if you count the snap decks with the snap decks foil, right? So that's like a lot of doubles for one box, right? Not as bad as that Ether Revolt box. Nothing will ever be as bad as that, I'm pretty sure. Um, and I'm pretty sure that box was totally a, like a mishandled box. And Wizards was just like, mm, and it just happens. And I was like, mm, I don't know about this. I don't know about this. I mean, sure, I'm sure it does, but I don't think it should happen. Anyway, thank you so much, everyone, for watching. I have been your host, Mr. Brevers. I hope you enjoyed this box number three of Ikoria. Stay tuned for next week for box four. We'll see what we get there. Maybe we can hit some more of the mythics that I'm missing, because I'm missing a whole bunch of mythics from this set, because we've hit a lot of the same mythics out of the boxes we've opened. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. I have been your host, Mr. Brevers, and as always, may your pulls... I ever be better.